and gentlemen, welcome to the Champions Pole unveiling here at the Knoxville Nationals. Kind of our kickoff event for the afternoon. So when I was preparing for this, thinking about what question can I ask Donnie that he probably hasn't been asked, I sat in my motorhome and stared at the wall for about three hours and couldn't come up with anything. So as I got to doing some research on Donnie's performance at the Nationals, I came up with some things that I thought were kind of interesting, so I thought I might read those off to you. This will be Donnie's 29th Knoxville Nationals. His first was in 1998, where he started 7th and finished 4th. He won the World Challenge in 01 in 2012. He won the B-Main in 2013 and started on the pole, or excuse me, started on the front row eight times. He started on the pole six times. The first time was in 2001. His 22 top 10 finishes, all-time Nationals lap leader with 339 laps. He's qualified for the AMA 24 times. So let's start to finish in 07 and 2015. He got his first Nationals win in 06 in his family's car. He's an 11-time Nationals winner. He has 28 career wins here at Knoxville, which is 10th on the all-time win list. Only thing I can figure he hasn't won here during the Nationals is Rookie of the Year. So that's a pretty impressive list of things. So what we're wondering is, can you come for the 360 Nationals as a rookie next year and win that? <laughs> I think that's a possibility, yeah. It'll be fun. It's, uh, it's a lot of stats there. It's pretty surreal to think about. Uh, you know, I'm only 29 years old, too, so. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's... Um, I can tell you, I've enjoyed every second of it. It's been great. Uh, it's, it's been an honor to be here and to be standing here again today with all you guys. It's um, the one thing that's never wavered in, in all those years is the, the atmosphere here. This is uh, just incredible. Uh, it's, it's almost like when this week is over that it's it's almost depressing. But then you realize you're going to go do the you know get back in the race car, the thing that you love to do the following week somewhere else. It's just not here. So uh, that that always helps. But uh, it makes it really special for me to, to see all these people here. And get to enjoy it with you. I know I get I get to be on the good side of it for sure, but um, it's been an honor. You have a pretty cool uh, new paint scheme this weekend. Tell us about that. Yeah, um, I didn't actually see it till I got here uh, last night. Uh, it's monochrome. You know, it's uh, it's actually really cool. It's it's hard to keep coming up with uh, festive ideas that, that people are going to love. Um, I, it's all different colors of blue, and then. I just walked in there and seen they had us put three of the track stickers that are red, so there's only, <laughs> it, it looks a little odd, they really pop, you'll, you'll be able to pick it out plain as day, but um, it's really cool, um, everybody at TSR always goes over and above to make sure their stuff looks really good, uh, the race team's incredible at, at how they do this and get prepared, and, um, I just hope it's really fast and it can park out on the stage tonight, that's the, that's the main goal. So when you won this race 11 times, do you still get that? I've won at this fame event 11 times when you walk in here. Absolutely. Um, you know, it's like I said earlier, it's hard to put into words what um, winning it that many times has done. I know the, the first one, I wish every one of you could experience it, um, even the, any racer. That's just not how it works. Um, that, that, that excitement just never goes away. And, and even though you win it again and again, it's still as exciting. But man, that first one, uh, it almost feels like you've, you've won life. Uh, from here, it's all it's all downhill, and uh, I've been very fortunate to be on the good side of it for a lot of years. So, but you have to put that behind you. What happened last year and what happens on this pole right now has no bearing on today, and uh, that's why we keep coming. It's a competition. It's what we love to do, and try to do it again. Well, let's celebrate last year's win one more time. We're going to count down from three to one, and when you do, the curtain's going to come down on Donnie's championship pole. It has all 11 years on it. Let's count them down. Three, Three two, two, one. one. Woo! I don't know about you, but I get new goosebumps when I see that. Yeah, it does. But uh, like I said, you got to let it go. It's, it's all about today. I'm just lucky to have everybody here enjoying it with us. It's a good way to start off the week, so we'll see if we can cap it off again. Good luck this week. Thank you. Thank you.